Mama showed me pictures of their wedding day. I can tell. I believe Daryl Mackin would be an amazing honorary recipient of the Wesley Mortgage Community Hero Award. I met Daryl Mackin in 2015 when I joined a Soldier's Child Foundation after the loss of my military husband. My four children have received birthday presents in the mail each, each year, year since, since their daddy's death. death. We have also enjoyed going to the fun camps where we've with it, long lasting friendships, lasting friendships with kids. other amazing kids just, just like, like them. Us. And now we'll be able to receive secondary and college scholarships. Daryl's foundation now serves close to 5,000 children across the United States who have lost a military parent. Our lives and so many others' lives have been completely changed because of Daryl's choice to say yes to this calling. We have been given hope to live out a courageous future, honor, and love from Daryl and his outstanding organization. A Soldier's Child, Child foundation. foundation. What are you doing, dude? Well, I was just scrolling down Facebook and I saw something on there that said, uh, we're looking for community heroes. And I immediately responded with your name and an organization. And about a week later, I started getting phone calls from this Titans organization and man, it happened fast. <laughs> Tell me, what's Daryl like? He's, he's amazing. He's definitely like a father figure to us. Um, we love his family, we love his wife, his kids. I met him on my 13th birthday, so he threw us a party. My sister and I, we both have February birthdays, mm -hmm. and he's just kind of always been there for, been yeah. there for us. It's yeah, really it's, brought a lot of healing, just like seeing that there's other people out there that are experiencing what we are experiencing, mm -hmm. and that they can also relate and they can help us get through it. Daryl first started his organization after his neighbor lost his son. He was about a month out from his return, and that's when they got the news that he had died. And Daryl was there and supporting his, his friend, and, and finally his friend in, um, in frustration and in grief, he said to Daryl, Did it matter and does anybody care? And those two questions struck Daryl really hard, and he didn't go home that night. He ended up walking the neighborhood and then as I was prepping for my own son's sixth birthday, I caught an attitude of all the work that went into it. And then I found myself staring at that image of the boy receiving his father's flag. And then I realized that what I get to give my son, there are so many children that will never get that from their father. And I still get to give that gift. But this letter is the reason why um, I do what I do. Nothing else matters to me than this sentiment, that we celebrate the children and they feel celebrated. We honor our fallen and the surviving tells us that we do. And then we give the children a hope to live out a courageous life and they are. That's it.